Hi everyone, welcome back to the Laravel AT Commerce tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn about adding product to the wishlist. So let's see how can we add product to wishlist. First of all, uh, let's add an icon on every product uh, from where we can add the product to the wishlist. Okay, so for that, switch to the project and uh, Let's open the shop component.blade.php file. So let's go inside the resources directory, then views, uh, live wire, and uh, uh, from here just open shop component.blade.php file. Alright, inside this file, you can see here this is the product list. Okay, and now inside this porridge, uh, inside this product info div. After this, add to cart link. Uh, this is add to cart link. Okay. So after this, uh, let's add here a div and also set the class name. Class and let the class name is product dash this. Okay. And inside this div, let's create a link anchor tag. Ref has and uh, add here the i tag class if a if it is hard. All right. Okay. Now let's add some CSS for this. So uh, inside this row, just add here uh, before this row. Add here the style tag. Okay, and inside this style tag, add here the class name, product. Uh, this one, product dash with. So just copy and paste here, and add here the position. Absolute. Top 10% and left 0 Z index ninety-nine. Okay, right 30 pixel and text align. Right. Okay. And also set the padding top, padding top zero. All right. And now add here the font if a color. Okay. Set the color. So right here, this class name dot if a and set the color. And if the color is C B C B C B. This one. Light grey color. Okay, and font size 32 pixel. Okay, and now just copy this class name and paste here. And here the hover effect over and set the color orange color. So add here the hash sign FF7007. Okay, this orange color. Alright, now save this file and let's check it. So switch to the browser and you refresh the page. Now you can see here a heart icon on each product. Okay. Alright. Now let's make uh, this link working. So for that, go to the sub component class file. So from the app directory, app HTTP, LiveWire, and from here just open soft component.php file. And inside this file, uh, let's create a function uh, for adding the product to the wish list. Okay, so after this function, uh, let's create a new function. So write here public function and function name. So function name is add to wish list. 
okay and inside this uh, pass the, uh, some argument i'm just going to copy this product id product name product price okay and paste here these are the arguments for this function all right and now inside this just write here cart colon colon and set an instance uh, instance and let's say instance name is with list okay now call the odd add function and inside this uh, just pass this one so just copy this one and paste here okay pass here the product id product name this one and quantity number of quantity and here price okay and also associate with product model so right here associate and inside this add here the app slash models slash model name which is product all right okay now save this file and now go to the sub component or below php file and uh, inside this file uh, inside uh, before this storage uh, let's add here php directive and uh, just close the php directive so right here add the in php and inside this create a variable the blue icon is equal to card colon colon instance and uh, write the instance name of this list this one now uh, just copy this instance name and paste here all right now call the content method int okay and block only id so just write here block and add the column name id all right okay now here uh, inside this class this div uh, before this heart with uh, heart icon just add here if directive and pick if dollar w items uh, this one w items okay colon contain contains and pass here the id product id so right here product hello id okay then uh, so this link and also add here the else part else and just copy this link and paste inside the else part okay and after this we we'll close here in the if directive in if all right if uh, if product id uh, uh, product id exists inside this w items then so uh, this link otherwise so this link okay if exists then show the heart color with orange color so we add here the class fill dash heart okay and now just copy this class name and uh, add inside the child seat and add here the dot fill heart and set here the color this color this orange color okay so add here the hash sign and picture all right okay now inside this uh, let's call here uh, this function add to this list so just copy this function name and here inside this anchor tag add here wired colon uh, click event click action dot event is equal to this function name and inside this uh, let's pass here the product id product name and product price okay so i'm just going to copy this one uh, from here to here and inside this add to this list this function just paste here okay 
all right now it's done so save this now open the blade uh, layout file uh, guess layout file so for that just go inside the resources directory and uh, views layouts and from here just open base.blade.php file okay and inside this layout file uh, you can see here this is just this is the wish list okay this icon this one okay so uh, and you can see here the number of items so before this is pen tag uh, just add here if and check if part colon colon instance and add here the instance name this one uh, this list so just copy the instance name and paste all right and call here the count method count if cart instance which uh, instance name is with list has more than one uh, more than zero then so this number of items okay and this is here the end and here uh, just copy this one and remove this zero and add a double curly bracket and paste here okay if number of item is greater than zero inside this wish list instance cast uh, cart instance okay with list instance uh, then so this all right okay now save this file all right uh, here do one thing uh, set uh, uh, instance to the cart okay also set here instance uh, to the cart so everywhere uh, you can see here this is the cart uh, so I'm just going to add here an instance in every cart okay so here first add here cart colon colon instance and inside this add here the instance name cart okay this is the cart instance and this is the wish list instance okay so now just copy this and change everywhere Uh, for the cart, okay. So inside this base layout file, this is for cart. So add here the instance name cart instance, okay. And this is the with list instance, okay. And also add here instance cart. Now save this file and sub component dot php file. We have already changed here. Okay, now save this file and now inside the soft component or blade or PHP file uh, change here products Okay, here all good now go to the cart component class file so from the app directory, just open here uh, live wire. Just open the cart component.php file, and uh, here uh, just to set here the instance for the cart. So select this and press Ctrl T, select all. Okay, now paste here. All right, instance and instance name is cart. Okay, this is for the cart. Now save this. And now go to the cart component view file. So just open cart dash component or blade or PHP file, and uh, here uh, just select this and press Ctrl plus D, select all. Okay. Now after this, just paste here. Okay. Instance cart, and okay. Now it's done. Now save all the file and now let's check this. So switch to the browser and just refresh the page. All 
all right now let's add the product to the wish list okay so i'm just going to add that product to wish list so i'm just going to click on this link okay it's not working okay you can see here this list added okay item added inside the this list but uh, colors color is not showing here uh, with orange color so simply inside this sub component of related php file inside this fill hard class uh, set the color and also add here the important okay call important this way now save this file now refresh the page Now you can see here the icon with orange color okay all right now let's add this one this product to the uh, to the wish list so i'm just going to click on this link and you can see here the color has been changed okay and you can see here uh, the number is not automatically updated okay but i i refresh the page you can see here the number of item inside this list uh, inside this with list number of item is two okay are two now let's try to add one more product inside this with list so let's click on this icon added and uh, if i refresh the page you can see here the number of product inside this with list number of product are three Okay, three items. All right, and also check the add to cart. So I'm just going to add here to click this link, add to cart, and you can see here the number of product inside the cart icon. Number of product is one. All right. So in this way, you can add the product to the wish list. In next video, we can see. how to auto refresh uh, the wish list count okay and also see the this card count okay so that's all about adding product to the wish list so thanks for watching this video and if you still have any kind of question you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel thanks for watching